Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a sketch of quality curve in modulus. Uh, this question is from New Admas book, chapter number 9.4, question number 5. Let's start. In the first part, the domain is given. The domain is from 1, 2, 3, and even they asked to find F1 and F3. So basically, we have to use domain to find the range. So first part is very simple f of 1 is equals to in the quadratic equation like in the modulus form i just need to substitute 1 and the result is coming 1 square is 1 minus 2 then it's coming minus 1 and minus 1 means it's coming 1 is equals to 1 because we make it positive so the coordinates we can write 1 comma 1 for the result Second, we need to find f of 3. So, in the modulus 3 square, minus 2 times 3, and then it's coming 9 minus 6. And in the modulus is coming 3. So, the f of 3 is coming 3. So, even you can write the coordinate 3, comma 3. So, this was the first part. We are doing actually the sketch of the graph. And... We have to write this. Do we have the one to one function or not? Let's see. Uh, when you want to draw the sketch of quadratic curve in the modulus, normally I advise to you just draw the curve of without modulus. This is the first step. Okay. In uh, like without modulus, what we need? We need first of all, uh, like complete square form is coming x minus 1 whole square and minus 1 square. And this is called a quadratic, like complete square form. And you can learn how we can uh, write this in complete square form from exercise uh, 4.1 and 4.2. You can watch my video from the same, like 4.1, 4.2. Then you will learn this how we can write the complete square form. The turning point is 1 and minus 1. So this is the turning point. And x square means your curve will be like this. Sorry, the curve will be like this, happy face. And the turning point is 1 and minus 1. So okay, let's see. And one more thing, uh, when you substitute normally like uh, this domain 1, f1, f1 is coming 1 square minus 2 times 1 is coming 1 minus 2 is coming minus 1. So the coordinate is 1 minus 1 and when you substitute 3 because I have to use the domain. So it's coming 3 square even we have done it but this was in modulus so 3 and 2 times 3 is coming 9 minus 6 is coming 3 so the coordinates are 3 comma 3. Okay 1, 2 and 3. Let's start to draw the sketch now. Okay to draw the sketch what we need? We need like 3 coordinates is okay. So let's start with the sketch now. So for a sketch, this one, and uh, we have one and minus one. Okay, this is minus, I'm just drawing till, because the domain is from, sorry, the domain is from one to three. So we do not need to like use this part. One till three is here is okay. 1 and 3. Okay. Uh, then here I'm just writing 1, 2 because maximum value of y is 3. So the first is the turning point is the turning point is 1 minus 1. 1 and the minus 1 is coming 1 and minus 1. This is the turning point first. I have to just. Okay, on the turning point, I always draw a line of symmetry. This is my method and I just told you in chapter 4. Okay, then uh, this is the turning point here. Second is 1 minus 1. Like 1 minus 1 is also here. Like turning point and the domain, like the domain which is from 1 to, you can see, domain is from 1 to so the turning point and the one point from the domain is coming same. So what do you mean by this actually? We have to use just one point and 3, 3 is coming about, 3, 3 is coming here. 
So when you draw the sketch, the sketch will be coming like this. And it should move like this. It should move like this because this is normally for a ticker, but we do not need this. So this, for this uh, part, and one more thing, you can observe one thing here. Uh, this this curve, when I draw this curve like this, this curve here, but because this model is sign, because we have drawn the sketch of x squared minus 2x, this is sketch of x squared minus 2x, and when we make the model is, this negative sketch will cut it out. It will, we don't need this. And this curve, which was like this, which was this part, it, uh, this one minus one will move here, one and one, which is here. And the curve will be like this. And this we have to remove, and this is the right curve. This is the curve of this quadratic with modulus sign, because this all negative value will move up, so this is the right curve. Now, they asked one thing in the question, we have, as we have done the curve, uh, determine uh, whether f is one-to-one -one function or not. Remember, for one-to-one -one function, if this curve is like this, and this curve is just only like this, like this, not this, this is one-to-one, -one because when we draw horizontal line, it's cutting just one point. But when, when uh, is the curve is like this, and there is no point here, so now, when we draw horizontal line, when it's cutting at two points, it's called not one to function one one to one function so this is not one to one function as we have done it if you want to check the answer we can check the answer uh, the answer is coming uh, f is not one to one function question number five and we have done it so by this way we have done question number five from nine point four i hope this this video is useful this is how we can draw the quadratic curve in modulus function thank you so much and have a nice day